<laughs> you got a cannon, but never a cannon. It's always more than just taking pictures. It's always. It's never just. I learned was seeing passion through somebody else's eyes. And that passion continued to grow and grow and grow and grow and grow. So there's no doubt on the reason on why she's doing this. Because she has a passion for it. She has a passion for people. And she has a passion for creating opportunities. And having that passion, I grew into my business. And she's helped me find passion and love and strength, even when I didn't want to do it anymore. So that's why I know starting over is going to be a huge success. Because she refused to let anyone fail around her, and she refused to let herself fail. She's a worry bug, don't get it wrong. She's a worry bug um, and worries on if things are going to be right, if things are going to be the right color, if it's going to be tall or short, if it's going to be you know five or ten, so forth and so on. But at the same time, that passion and that fire that stands behind everything that she does when it comes to herself, her family, and the people that she's trying to create opportunities for. There's no better opportunity and passion than investing in people that are looking for chances, a second chance, and a second opportunity in life. Our biggest commitment on the face of the earth, in my opinion, is to serve others and to create other opportunities for others, and that's exactly what you're doing. doing. Kill, she killed to most, kill to me, um, and to a lot of other people. You've done a fantastic job. You've started a nonprofit that targets opportunity. You're giving more than you've given yourself. You're giving to the community, and we love you for that. There's only a handful of people that will sacrifice their own for the opportunity for others. And you've done that. You told me that you started this vision back in 2015. Three years ago, you put pen to pad. And today we're celebrating, we're, we're hosting a banquet right now in order of starting over. We're here for the works of others. So what I ask y'all is to continue to support her passion and her love for starting over. Continue to support her passion for creating opportunities because we have a goal and an opportunity to start something amazing. And you all today are the frontiers and the founders of what starting over is going to look like when we pull up and it's thousands of people at a banquet or it's costing tens of thousands of dollars to get a ticket to come to the banquet banquet to starting over. We are the frontiers, we are the pioneers of making this happen on behalf of others. Shaquille, thank you so much for putting people before you because people need you, people need us. We love you, thank you so much. The founder of Starting Over. So, okay, so, okay, I won't be up here long, but first, giving an honor to God, who's the head of my life. Without him, I know nothing is possible, so that's just how I was raised. I'm looking at my pops, and I can feel him staring at me. So, <laughs> I'm going to start up with Proverbs 31:20, and it says, she helped the poor and the needy. If I had to sum up starting over, that would be it. So, um, what does starting over mean? To some, it means to begin again. Uh, for some, it means to start new. Sounds pretty simple, right? You would think. But starting over for me represents finding oneself. Uh, figuring out who you are before figuring out where and how to start. Some of us are fortunate enough to be born into a family that provides support, encouragement, even opportunities. Some of us are born into this world having to figure it out on our own. That's what started, that is when starting over intervenes. 
So here at Soar Nova, we want to provide a safe and stable living environment. We aim to give our young uh, continued education, trade opportunities, entrepreneurship, awareness to credit, and diverse unit, uh, avenues that expand beyond us. Everyone in here is either a business owner, they have a nonprofit, or they are aiming in the same direction that I am. So when God gave me the vision to start starting over, I was scared. I did call my brother. I said, hey brother, I don't know. He said, no, go back. I did call my pops. Pops, no, go back. I called my sister. Of course, she's very, well, A, point A, point B. But what it, what it made me do was realize and dig even deeper. And so this is how starting over begins. Notice I said it begins, because this is not where we're going to stop. It starts here, and it starts with all of us. So I want to just say thank you for coming out. Thank you for believing in me and supporting my vision that God spoke into me. And I promise I will not let you down. This is our journey together, and we're going to celebrate together. So thank y'all for coming out. We're going to turn over to the DJ. And I hope y'all have a good time. Thank y'all so much.